Hey y'all, so I'm back and in today's video as you guys saw it's going to be a makeup and motivation video Something new that I'm going to be doing on my channel and this video I'm just going to be basically Vented to you guys kind of but also give you guys like some type of tips or motivating Motivating whatever you want to call it. I'm going to give you guys like some tips just vent to you guys about Some, th some new things that are going to be coming to my channel some new things some things that I've been thinking about like uh developing into my channel and everything like that while still doing my makeup if you guys like to see how the if you guys like to see the look that i that i achieved later on in the video then please make sure to, to stay tuned to this video y'all i don't know what's wrong with me i haven't did a video in a few days and yeah and it very much shows so okay so it's not gonna be a makeup tutorial i know you guys have watched my makeup motivation videos the few that i did do in the past I don't do tutorials and makeup motivation videos. I just do my makeup. I'll frequently show you guys what I'm using, but for the most part, not a motivate. It's not a um, makeup tutorial, but I do make sure to leave the products that I use down in the description box below. I'm not really sure exactly what look I want to do. I don't really do too much when I do my makeup motivation videos, just because I don't know. Like I just really I can't focus, but then again, I like to balance each out, and I don't feel like telling you guys these products and still like talking and venting and talking my head off and stuff like that so anyway so i probably just do like a very neutral glam i haven't been doing those a lot on my channel so that's probably what i may do today uh, yeah i probably just do like a cranberry shimmer shade I mean shimmer eyeshadow or something i'm not really sure though but um anyway so yes yeah, going along with the um topic of the video so lately um you guys can see on my channel i have been very consistent i mean choosing to be very consistent these last past couple of weeks just because i really want my channel to grow and that was that is one of my biggest goals for this year is just allow my channel to grow i want to hit a certain amount of subscribers by the middle of this year and also a certain amount of subscribers by the end of this year so i know that i would have to like really work hard and like work very consistently in order to see those results and i can honestly say y'all and not even be joking that my channel has been growing so much i only been on youtube for i say about well okay technically it's been like eight months but i had took like a three month break and when i came back they made like six months so as far as like consistently it's been like six months since i started youtube and i can remember exactly how many subscribers i had the pace that my um views was getting and stuff like that with the pace that my views were at and stuff like that and compare from from then to now my channel has grown so freaking much and i'm so freaking excited because it is something i've been praying about i pray about, i pray about that all the time just you know just see my channel growing and stuff like that so it's definitely a blessing you know but i know that this wouldn't have happened if i was just if i would have never kept going and also you know it's always room to just become better and become bigger if you continue to do the same things that you've been doing so overall i'm very proud of myself but one thing that i can say um during those times where i'm consistent sometimes i do take breaks and which i always tell you guys there's nothing wrong with taking breaks and sometimes i feel like i just need to take breaks to just kind of like revamp myself but sometimes we can feel so overwhelmed doing everything that we feel like we need to be doing that sometimes it's cool to take a break to try to just relax and just kind of like enjoy the life that you already have like enjoy your life as it is now so i've been doing it a lot lately and overall i've been feeling very good though i mean i'm human so of course i get into these moods where i feel like you know something is not going right or i feel like something is not worth doing or something but overall i really have been feeling good i love getting up doing the videos staying up late four or five o'clock in the morning um editing videos and stuff i like that a lot because i know that in the end it will pay off so anyways, get into, because the video is mostly just about introducing to you guys some new things that you guys will see on my channel. Um, one of my one of my other big goals is just to become a lot more organized with the things that I do also on my channel and just other things as well. So I did come up with not a very detailed schedule, something I'm still working on, but overall like a an outline of a schedule. I have come up with one, like different types of content that I want to introduce to you guys. And that would include, of course, beauty content. I will never let go of my beauty content. As you guys can see, I'm still doing makeup tutorials. Also, I will be doing a lot more hauls. I have a few hauls on my channel, which I know you guys enjoy because my my most viewed video on my channel is my um, Shein Jenkins haul that has like 3,000 um, views. And I'm so freaking excited. And I swear, it goes 
it go, it gets higher like 200 views a day it gains like 200 views a day and i'm so freaking blessed and grateful to be able to have at least at least one video that's doing good i have a lot of videos that are doing good i actually make sure to screenshot them and put them in the video like screenshot a picture of putting the video so that you guys can make sure to check those videos out also make sure to leave them down in the description box below because they have been doing so freaking good and i just know that's the sound of me just working very very hard so i just want to kind of give you guys a generalization not very detailed like a generalization of the type of content that i'm introducing to my um my youtube channel so i did come with a schedule as far as like what video i'm going to do each day what type of video i'm going to do each day i do want to include a lot more like vlogs well i haven't vlogged on my channel yet but i do want to do a lot more vlogs especially like this summertime and spring um i want to of course like i said do hauls of course do more makeup tutorials i also want to do more um videos as far as like me doing clients makeup i am about to start getting ready and doing makeup for other people and also i do have a list of models that i'm going to be doing makeup for on my channel so i would definitely making sure to record those and so that you guys will be able to see like how i do makeup for other people i already have a video there on my channel i make sure to leave that down description box below and also in the i card above you guys can click on it it'll literally take you straight to that video so yeah so that you guys will basically see how i do makeup on other people because i know you guys probably didn't think i do makeup for other people because i'm always doing makeup for myself on my channel but i definitely do and i am very good at it so yes that's definitely something that i will be doing more on my channel um like i said a lot more vlogs well a lot of vlogs will be introduced on my channel also a lot of family challenges that's definitely something that i'm waiting to uh start doing but when i start doing them y'all yes i do have a well i don't have a couple yet but i do have at least one well i have like two three on my channel already i make sure to put those down in the description box below how about I just like, put all my videos in the description box below honestly y'all but for real, for real though um yeah so my yeah i definitely will be doing a lot more challenges my family wants me to do a lot more family challenges and just like just makeup challenges stuff that like very fun and entertaining you know makeup can be entertaining but only to people who love makeup you know so i definitely want you guys to see a different side of me because i'm very funny i like to make jokes and you know i like to laugh and stuff like that so why not add it to my youtube channel if my youtube channel is supposed to be about me so what in which i actually have a lot of different family challenges ideas that i'm going to be including on my channel some that will be posted this week so please make sure to stay tuned turn on post notifications so that y'all would never miss so that y'all won't miss those uploads but like i said i would definitely be incorporating a lot of family challenges and just like challenges that have to do with me like any makeup challenges or just anything that you guys like to see honestly um another another type of uh content i want to do like a lot of different um makeup looks not just like the same type of looks like just glitter looks i want to do like creative looks like cartoon themed looks all of those like definitely going to be expecting a lot of different content this week like literally this week like this is monday i'm posting this video on monday so i'm posting every day this week honestly probably like two or three days two or three videos a day like that's that's the type of grind i'm trying to be on i've been trying to be on this type of grind these last couple weeks and I want my channel to be very very different because a lot of people youtube channels don't really be about them a lot of people start off with like with like their youtube channel being about them like for example their beauty influencers or they inspire beauty influencers they start off doing makeup tutorials but then they start seeing that the challenges and the pranks is what really makes the money they start doing that i don't want to do that i want to forever keep my beauty content like i just i love makeup so i want to broadcast that but like i said i would definitely because i have a lot of different interests and stuff i like cooking i like doing all of this so like i said just be expecting of uh, just so much more content y'all and this is going to be so different and i know that they will be able that will allow people to really draw towards my channel when they see that i enjoy doing every single thing that i have on my channel so um uh, what's some other things that i have planned uh for my channel um i have my notebook right here i'm actually show y'all my notebook that i got 
I had it in the last video. I've been having this notebook uh, since the beginning of this year. And this is like my daily notebook. I write any ideas that I have as far as like YouTube videos or just anything that I want to do. I put it in that notebook so that I won't forget it. So I have like three pages full of YouTube video ideas. Here's my notebook right here. I got it from my job, the last job that I was, that I was at. And it's like so cute. And I write in there every single day. And I just have so many different hauls for y'all, like um, designer dupe hauls. I have shoe hauls, bags hauls, shein hauls, pretty little thing hauls, all of that stuff. I got lashes, a lot more lashes haul because my lash haul is at 800 views, y'all. And that I posted it like two months ago, probably a little bit over two months ago, probably not even a whole two months ago. I posted that video and it's been doing so freaking good, y'all. Like I just can't believe like the fact that my channel is growing so much. I can't do nothing but be grateful on it. So, um, oh, let's, let's see what some more videos that I got. I'm not going to tell you the exact ones, but I'm going to tell you the type of ones that I have. Um, like I said, challenges, client makeup videos. I got hair tutorials. I'm actually dropping a hair tutorial on my channel. Um, I'm going to say tomorrow. Yeah, I'm going to say tomorrow. That channel going to be posted. That video is going to be posted tomorrow. So, be expecting a hair tutorial. Um, and a lot more hair tutorials after that, you know. Because actually my ponytail, my genie ponytail that I did on my channel um, about a month ago, that is doing so freaking good, y'all. Like, it's just crazy how, like, I pretty much know exactly what you guys like to see. Even though I don't really get, like, a lot of, like, feedback as far as, like, comments. But I know just off of, like, the status of my videos, I know exactly what you guys like to see. So, it's only right for me to continue doing those type of videos because that's another way that my channel will be able to grow. Is if I give you guys what I want while still being very interested in the topic you know as well so i'm not gonna do a knee cut cream like i said i wasn't even supposed to do all of this y'all i just got carried away honestly but that's always so i'm not gonna do like a little no cut crease cut crease look so i'm just going with my pubes base and i'm just gonna get like a little buffer not a buffer brush like a little flat shade brush and just kind of like do a very unneat cut crease Y'all know my cookery to be way knitted in this, so it's just for me to apply my lid. I want my lid colors to be very, very pigmented and like show very, very good. So this is what I'm doing this. Then I'm just gonna go in with like a little tall buffer brush and just buff around it so that it won't look so neat. So like I always like to say at the end and beginning of all my videos to so make sure that y'all comment down video suggestions and like I said I don't have a huge channel so I you know I expect not to have like a lot of comments and stuff like that I do get comments here and there but I do want y'all to start coming I'm gonna do a full dedicated video on this type of topic but like I said I do want to start seeing a lot more comments so that I will know exactly what videos to do but I feel like the videos that I have in mind to do are like very good videos so yeah there's no reason really to stress about my channel growing because I know that I'm naturally a different person like I'm naturally somebody that other people don't act like other people don't do things that I do or I don't do things that other people do so I know that just by me being that type of person that's going to allow my channel to grow so I haven't been stressing over the fact that I'm trying to I want my channel to grow it's just really like more so like I don't know how to I don't, I'm not, I'm not gonna say I don't know how to start doing it but I can't really explain it but like I said I'm gonna do a full dedicated video on that um as far as like the scheduling of like the type of videos that I'm going to do on Mondays um you guys will expect uh, a motivation a makeup motivation video that's something that I want to become a series on my channel that you guys will expect it because like I said just like I like to motivate people a lot of people that I know personally like my friends and stuff like that they love me motivating and just giving advice and stuff like that so I know that that will play a huge role in like my channel growing and stuff a lot of people may not like how I do my makeup a lot of people may not like makeup at all but some people may come on my channel just like some people may come on the next part of the channel just for like the motivational words they may have the encouraging words they may have a lot of times i like to go on people's challenge not not because of the things they do but like the words they say you know so i definitely want to incorporate a lot more of that because i love motivating i love inspiring i love giving advice and stuff like that so i come up with the conclusion with the idea to do makeup motivation i'm gonna call it makeup motivation monday so did you guys be expecting a, a makeup motivation video every monday unless something happens and i can't really post it which we're not going to think about 
on every Saturday will be expecting a challenge. So whether it be like a challenge with just me, or if it be a family challenge, or just anything that has to do with like a challenge or pranks and stuff like that, we expect those on Saturday. I may be posting more than one ch challenge, but challenge like I'll call it entertainment day, and then that'll be like anything that's like entertainment purposes. Will be on Saturday, Sunday will be like client makeup tutorials, like if I do a model's makeup or if I do a client's makeup, and I want to record and put it on YouTube. We expect those on Sundays. But if I do a hair tutorial, that I probably like on any day I post that, whichever day that I'll be able to do my hair, and then I'll be able to post it. I'm just going to end with like a cranberry shade shimmer, which is in a back, I mean not the back to Brazil palette, a BH Cosmetics palette. I'll make sure to leave it down in the description box below. I'm just going in with that, and I'm going to put a back putting that in the middle of my lid because I do want to go in with a lighter shade for the inner corner. Now I'm going to go in with a, um, it's like a neutral tone gold. I'm going to go in with that and I'm going to put that in the inner corner. This is a very simple glam, although it's looking a little bit more smokier. It is very, very simple. It's not a cut crease, but it's like more, it's like a messy cut crease. It's what it kind of call like a no cut crease, cut crease look. So this is very cute though. It's very, very cute. I ain't going nowhere, y'all. I've been feeling so much better. Like a lot of times, like I told you guys, a lot of times, I do be feeling like my channel, I must have never grow because I never think like that when it comes to myself. I never think like, oh, I won't be able to make it or anything like that. I, when I tell you, I never think down on my life and I never think down about myself more than anything I'll just always be wondering how am I going to get that, to that position like I know the only way is to be consistent but it's like sometimes I don't feel like being consistent not just I don't feel like but a lot of times I just be feeling like it's impossible to be consistent all the time like even some of the people that we look up to can, can I feel like can vouch for me when I say that like I mean yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, you know that you have to be consistent, but a lot of times you won't feel like being consistent. So, uh, and I feel like, I feel like that a lot. <laughs> and it may be bad, I mean, I mean, in a way it is, in a way it's not, honestly. But, um, you know, a lot of times I don't be feeling like being consistent. Not far as, like, I don't feel like doing a video, like, on some physical level, but I'm talking about as far as, like, on a mental level. Like, sometimes I be feeling like it's not the right time to be consistent. Like, I just be feeling like my mind be everywhere, and I don't feel like being consistent on YouTube or just, like, consistent with other things that I got going right now, like, that I'm trying to accomplish right now. But ever since that, um... Ever since I posted my vision board video, you guys, my vision board video is also doing very good, and I'm extremely blessed. Like, I love when videos like that, like become like very popular on my channel because it lets me know that people enjoy those type of videos and I and I enjoy them even more you know but anyway so ever since around that time I've been writing in my um uh, I've been writing my daily notebook and I've been like I told you guys earlier I've been writing out any uh, videos ideas or anything like that and ever since I've been doing that I just honestly overall I've been becoming a lot more just optimistic when it comes to my channel like I feel like there's nothing that can't that'll make me just want to stop or want to quit or want to give up because I just have so much things that I want to present and it's like if I just not do it it's like those things will never will never come like come to play and it's like those is like good ideas like it's some real good ideas y'all and I just know those things are just going to allow my channel to really grow and every time I think about that every time I look at my notebook and I just see the things I have come up with I get so freaking like I just feel so happy I just feel so freaking pleased and I feel so proud of myself because I'm really taking the steps to really be consistent a lot of times I be saying I'm being consistent with something and then I'll be consistent for a couple weeks and then I'll just stop but overall y'all I have been very consistent I have missed a couple days or whatnot but it's a lot better than I used to be. I used to miss months without posting and stuff like that. But I have really been on my stuff. And I'm very proud of myself. Just know my channel is for the girl. I can literally feel it, y'all. I've also been doing a lot of praying. And I just know, like, I just know that God sees me as worthy of, you know, of being able to just grow. And 
y'all. When I tell y'all, it's something that I've been praying about. And I've been trying to make YouTube my priority because that is the reason why I quit my job. Not just YouTube, but I mean, other things as well, of course. But overall, YouTube has to be one of the biggest things that I'm trying to achieve this year. Well, this year anyway, I, I want to be in a certain position. Um, by the end of this month and also by the middle of this month. I mean, not the middle of this month or the end of this month, but the end of this year and the middle of this year. So I have to give uh, uh, YouTube a large portion of my time, you know, of course, without neglecting the other things as well. And I also have like a lot of like different fashion content besides just hauls. I have like lookbooks in mind because I, your girl got fashion. I got style. I know how to dress y'all. And it's only right that I incorporate like some lookbooks, like how to do this, how to do that. I want to do lifestyle content as far as like, uh, I've been supposed to do this video like a long time ago, which was uh, reacting to my old pictures. Supposed to be did that. I probably do that pretty soon, like the next couple of weeks or whatnot. Um, also doing videos like how I edit my pictures. I was supposed to have been did that. Still haven't done that yet, but I'll definitely be making sure to do those videos. I mean, y'all do those videos for you. For y'all right now i just do just makeup videos i mean which i have no problem with if i did i wouldn't be doing them but makeup is my passion y'all i will always love makeup makeup will always be my first love y'all i've been loving makeup since forever so where is my foundation beginning part of February I wasn't doing videos that much so this I started like really planning my videos the second part of February you guys can see then on the side it's like some to do things to do daily and stuff like that and I'm gonna show y'all like January I just plan stuff and then I do the videos so it's like a lot going on here and then like if I'm doing a break if I'm like taking a break from the two I'll like keep it blank or something so that I will know so that by the end of this year so when the end of this year comes I'll be able to look back on this planner and see exactly what all I did to get to where I'm going to be at, at the end of this year so it, these two things that I showed y'all just now have been a life changer y'all like I have been so much more dedicated and so much more just just really happy and excited to start um well to do a video each and every day like seriously it's been so it's been so easy for me to be a lot more consistent when i write down what i'm supposed to be doing or what i'm supposed to be achieving just blending this out y'all i did the all in one method i've been doing this method literally in every video the last past two weeks or so i haven't done it off camera yet but i just decided to do my complexion part on camera because i haven't done a little minute on um, Going in with my Kabuki brush, I got this from the uh, Shop Miss 8 website. I always make sure to leave my utensils that I use in the description box below. If you guys want to check it out, the Shop Miss 8 website um, is a makeup company, it's a brand. They have their own products and they also have like other products, other brands as well. And everything on their website is a dollar, and this brush was a dollar. y'all you guys will get an idea of the different videos that i'm going that i'm going to be now having on my channel y'all like it's not just going to be just you like just makeup tutorials it's going to be a lot of different content y'all and y'all are going to love it i promise y'all a lot of them are are content that i have not seen anyone else on youtube do whether it's makeup tutorials or whatever it is makeup and motivation and videos um challenges pranks and stuff a lot of that stuff i haven't seen other people do so yeah when i say it's different content it's different content and y'all just gotta stay tuned y'all just gotta stay tuned subscribe to this channel turn on the post notifications so that y'all won't miss those uploads because when i said my vision was 
was right here, I meant it. And when I said I was gonna be a lot more consistent this year, I meant it. And I'll make sure to keep my word, not only to myself, but to my subscribers. Now I'm just gonna set using my Maybelline Fit Me Powder in the shade 35 medium deep. Also, another thing that I'm gonna start doing on my channel, I don't, I'm not really too fond of doing them just because I don't know, like, I know you have, you know, you have like different beauty channels and stuff where you have some people that just don't do reviews, they just like to stick to the same products, like the products that work for them. I like to do that because for one, a lot of products don't really work for me because of my skin. I have very, very sensitive skin, so a lot of the, a lot of the products, like a lot of people's favorite products, I can't use because. My skin is like very, very sensitive, so that's most of the reason why I like to do like reviews or just like uh, just try out every single different product. But if there's something very interesting, like an eyeshadow palette or a new lipstick or something or something like that, I would definitely be um, happy to do stuff like that for y'all, like um, reviews and stuff. Like I said, for the most part, I don't really care too much for them, but depending on the product, I would definitely be happy to do reviews. I want to reach 5,000 subscribers by June which is the sixth month of the year but i feel like of course that'll be a reasonable time to do five to have five thousand subscribers that's why it's definitely important for me to um have a lot of different content in mind instead of just free balling on the content like not knowing exactly what kind of content i want to do because when you care not careless but when you clueless like that you don't know you don't even know your goals and you don't even know what you want to achieve and i know what i want to achieve so I gotta be on my A game. Period. Also, another thing is that I made a new Instagram, my um, underscore beauty by Portia, which will be down down here on, on the screen and also in the description box below. Um, I want you guys to follow the Instagram because that's where I'll have like all my fashion pictures, like when I take pictures, like my, my best clothes, best fits on stuff. Better be on that on that um, page. And then the 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 um the one that I just met a couple days ago is called Faces by Portia. That will be where all my makeup is at. So if it's like makeup on myself, or makeup on clients or models that I do in like in the near future, all of that type of content and you know content and stuff will be on that page. So I did that because I wanted to be like a balance. I wanted to be able to balance the two, and I didn't want my one Instagram to feel like it was just overpowering, which is fashion pictures and it wasn't really focused on makeup pictures i don't know like there's a lot of different reasons why but i got i would do a dedicated video on that as well but um yeah i went ahead and decided to do like separate instagram accounts because i feel like it'll be better make sure to leave them both down in the description box below and also make sure to have them at the screen so that you got to be able to follow my accounts they're well the uh faces by caution one is fairly new so i don't really have that many followers yet but if you gotta go follow me i would definitely have some followers like, uh, lately, I've just been doing like, a lot of brainstorming, you know, of course, I've been doing, actually working as well, but I've been doing like, a lot of brainstorming on what to do next, so, so yeah, that's just one of the things that I came up with doing, decided to do. So now I'm just going to contour using, I'm going to use this one, I actually haven't used this one in a while, I've been using the Back to Brazil one, well not Back to Brazil, I keep saying Back to Brazil, the BH Cosmetics one lately, but I want to use this one for this specific, specific look, I'm going to be going in with this shade right here. forgot how pigmented this was like i actually love the tone of it it's a warm undertone and that's the tone for me so yes i have a lot of a lot of videos in mind y'all but i would definitely be open to receiving any other type of video ideas people do be in dming me from time to time and ask me to do certain videos y'all so i also wrote those down as well but if you have any more suggestions, you could leave them down in the comment box below. Or you can DM them to me on Instagram. But regardless, my camera battery is like almost completely dead. So what I'm going to just do is I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of my look off camera. Or the look of my makeup off camera. And I'll be right back with the outro. So yes, you guys, this concludes, that concludes this video. And I just went ahead and just completed everything off camera. I went ahead and just did like this cute, like little high top knot. High, yeah, high top knot. I don't know exactly what it's called, a top knot. I've been doing this lately. My edges down and whatnot. And then I just got like the little curly this right here. 
period I, mean, I really do love how it looks i just did like a nude pink gloss to go with it and then i also just add a little highlight i didn't want to do too much so i didn't really put any highlight on my cheekbones i just put some on my brow bone if you guys can see the tip of my nose a little bit of my cupid's bow and a little bit on bridge of my nose as well i put my lashes on beauty spot store lashes of course i'll make sure to link down in the description box below i added some black liner and some black mascara to my waterline and my lash line the theme of this video the moral of this video is just to keep going guys so anything you do just make sure you just keep going honestly and that's just what i'm trying to do you know um one thing that i can't say that i would definitely um advise you guys to just plan ahead you know make plans and write down ideas and just become better at being consistent with knowing exactly what it is that you have to do next because like I told you guys earlier, that'll allow you to be a lot more ready to do it. A lot, you'll, you'll feel a lot more ready to be consistent. Well, before I started like writing down in my daily notebook, I would uh, come up with ideas and stuff. I would have it in my mind when or when I then I end up forgetting like the idea, and so it was just like wow like now i don't know what it is i just like i told you guys earlier i've been feeling very good also like i was telling you guys uh, in a video as well is that um just be ready to um expect a lot more different content and just a lot of content from my channel because my channel will be definitely progressing in a lot of different ways it'll be a lot more supervised and a lot more um scheduled and uh put together i feel like my mind is on a good level i feel like i'm pretty much level-minded and i'm pretty much steady at being consistent honestly and i just want you guys to do the same thing in whatever you're doing it don't have to be youtube it don't have to be makeup it don't have to be anything that i got going on it can be school you know anything anything it is just start planning your days you know planning to, to study planning to do anything that you want to do just plan to do it daily and you will see results it may not be minor results but you will definitely see results of you know you know like you know it'll be like little results but you have to in order for you to get to the big results like you want to be able to take big leaps you have to be able to get over you have to be able to for one get through the obstacles and for two you have to be able to um just take the little small lips first you won't be able to walk until you learn how to crawl if that makes sense so yeah this is what i mean basically and yeah like i said keep saying for like the hundred time expect more content from my channel if you guys like how this book turned out if you guys like this to know the, the products that i use for this specific look i'll make sure to leave them down in the description box below if you guys like how this look turned out please make sure to leave a like on this video subscribe to my channel turn on the post notifications so that you guys don't miss any more uploads and also comment down video suggestions that you guys would like to see anything that you guys like to see from me and my channel make sure to leave them down in the description box below and also make sure you guys follow my two instagrams faces by Korsha and underscore beauty by Korsha. they'll be at the bottom of the screen also in the description box below and with that being said i'll see you guys in the next video